I'm Psycho 100 Season 2, Episode 9. Man, dude, la listen. I'm still a little bit in denial here because this show has faked me out a couple times already as far as people dying. Now, this uh, this is different. That, that could have all just been like the misdirect to like just make me completely because I because who expected that to happen right fucking show just out of nowhere just us killing Ritsu and both their parents like that is so I'm a little in denial but mob of course you know just him just going into that surreal moment of like life not even feeling real like when some crazy shit is happening around you you just go into this state of like is this even happening and then you're just going through and he's just hoping like they're okay they're okay everything's fine and my dad's strong you know my mom is cautious you know they went um and then to see just those charred corpses man like what the fuck dude i again uh, at the end of it i was like fuck dude fuck show fuck like all of this dude honestly just so so in me being in between just like this is fucking despair and suffering in between that and my denial i just have to see what happens next man so let's see what the hell Ooh, because we saw mob at the end of that man and that was ooh, that was the ultimate emotion from mob man that is that is just pure loss and despair man there's nothing like that man nothing so and to see that reflected in his powers is just yeah for sure man that's some like that's some angsty shit right there for sure but we'll see we'll see how the hell that goes man and um yeah let's go beginning the episode in three two one Dimple was like, close your eyes. Yo. Oof. Maybe not right now. Wait. No fucking way. It is fake? So Sho was trying to bait Mob. No fucking way. Or is Dimple just trying to protect his feelings right now? Yo. Mob. Wait. Oh, shh. Did he, yeah, did he just learn how to locate them? Oh, my goodness. Oh, mob. All right, let's go get him, buddy. I think, fuck, they're okay. I'm glad this show faked me out one more time right there. Obsession, there you go. Yeah, we at 100% right now. Because this is still, like, still a big problem. <laughs> Dropped in like Hancock, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Like a fucking superhero. Jesus, man. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> well, all right. So, thank goodness that my denial paid off there. Because on one hand, I was like, this could be happening. I might not be like, because I'm, because like in mob situation, I like, I'm, I want to believe they're okay. I like, I can't believe I'm seeing this shit, right? So I'm like, maybe, but I was pretty sure I was wrong about that. So, <sighs> damn it, one. <laughs> Don't do that to me again, man. But yeah, it's still a problem. They definitely, um, they definitely were trying to bait him with that, so. And apparently, uh, <laughs> Mogami is just watching him from a distance. At least going off what he said before. We're gonna get to that point in the opening, I see right there, man.
Are you another claw crony? Oh, wow. He wasn't buying that. Damn, just right away. Oh. Your target, huh? Uh, I don't know if you want to try that, buddy. Bro, you don't even know. <laughs> you, on the other hand, are not. Just straight up. Huh. Is that all you can do? <laughs> wow. You said that's all? You're free to go. It's like it couldn't have been you. He's trying to find whoever took them. Yo, mob needs to confirm. Huh. Just, yeah, this must, must look crazy to everyone. So a barrier and you just are super strong. <laughs> That's one of some of his power. <laughs> Bob is not playing with y'all. Oh my god. Yo. Oh yeah. He needs to make sure. Oh, that's right. So I guess show just preemptively went for him. But he doesn't know it was show, of course. Shut up, you crony. Oh, he wants that. Mob wants that. Uh-huh. An umbrella? Oh, this motherfucker. Wait, are you good now? You chill, bro? <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah, former claw. There you go. There you go. Hey, looks like they're they're chilling now. No, mob's like, yeah, fuck this shit. I don't blame him. Wait, Reagan. <laughs> to fucking make this car fly. <laughs> Yo. Damn. I guess if he can save anyone he cares about, I guess it's a clue too. Oh, this guy. Salt and pepper over here. I remember you. That mob doesn't give a fuck about you, dude. Oh, look at this group. And that's how it happened. So we got the squadron right here. Okay, so he wasn't completely bullshitting. Okay. I mean, yeah, if he's wrong. Because, yeah, we don't actually know yet. I don't know. Because there's not... I don't think there's a power to create dummies, but... Uh... <laughs> Now that is a hell of a lie right there. Uh. Damn. Okay. Wow. All the way down to two. Yeah, he was in a crazy emotional state. Y'all the former claw. It's good for us.
That's great, buddy. Creepy motherfucker. Makes sense. Oh, look at those. True, true, true. Upper echelon. <laughs> Don't let them find out you're a fraud. <laughs> there you go. I mean, they seem fine for now. Oh, it's on fire. Oh, yeah, the marathon. Yeah, Teru. Yeah, he got ambushed, but I guess he's alright. I think exchange emails. <laughs> Poor guys. Yeah, Teru's. He's too cool. Huh. I know, right? Just remind us who you are, real quick. Hey, there's our boy. Cool. I, I didn't mention this before, but it's cool that his hair grew back. <laughs> this shit again. <laughs> you would know. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what the hell? To the police. <laughs> Even Ted is like, bro. Oh. Nice lighter. Oh boy. Foreigners, huh? I guess that means European. Oh. Oh my god. Toichiro. Oh boy. Huh. No, it's such a like basic typical evil motivation that Oh. That's a useful power. Any kind of system. Wow. Huh. A mere fraction. Oh, poor Shinra. <laughs> oh boy. Everyone's trolling. Edgelord Lolololo. <laughs> I mean, they're not wrong, but 
They're actually real. Wait, so is Sho acting on his own? Wait, what? Wait, so where's... Where's... Wait, so Sho really did stage? Wait, really? Sho staged that just to oppose his own father? Oh my gosh. Whoa. Wow. Okay, this is crazy. Fuck, fuck it, as long as they're okay. That's crazy. All right. All right, thank goodness, man. I was actually worried. It's like, I hope they weren't lying completely. I know Sho's voice from somewhere. I don't know where. There's something familiar about his voice. Uh -uh. Jesus, man. Tamaki. First division leader. Damn. About a thousand. That's awesome. <laughs> uh. Oh, at the yeah, this is interesting. Oh, interesting. Oh, we have a bunch of different stuff going on here. Oh, uh, uh, they're like, okay, <laughs> oh boy. Holy shit. Oh my god. It's like even stronger than that guy from earlier. I'm gonna punch you now. <laughs> yeah, this, this plan's kind of... Oh. Oh, interesting. The Japanese government. Oh. This is another wrench I didn't expect. Pretty interesting. Oh. Uh, oh, this guy with the umbrella we saw earlier. Oh, shit. White noise, huh? Damn, it all solidified. Good shit. Nice. Uh. So much for Miguel. <laughs> I feel like this leader is the real deal. Oh my gosh. Ultimate five. Damn. <laughs> so much for the upper echelon. It looks like these five are the ones that really matter. Damn. Yeah, similar type. All right, then. Okay, yeah, I guess that's all you need. You didn't give a shit about the rest of you. Alright, well, so much for this guy. With this umbrella? Jesus. 
a shed in. Good job, man. Damn, just got away. Ooh, I guess, uh, eat up before you fight. <laughs> Borgar. Yeah, you need mob. <laughs> to Master Reagan. Welp. Oh. Oh. The hell? Oh. There's Shimazaki. I don't like those eyes, buddy. Get down, Mr. Mi Prime Minister. Oh boy, he doesn't seem to care. Oh, Welp. Yeah, don't just be firing the crowd behind him. Uh, that's more than predicting. Wait, even if he's hit, yo, this guy might be the real trouble. What the, yeah, what would that be? He can teleport. What the fuck? So nothing can hurt him. He can predict movements and he can teleport. Because why the fuck not? This guy is ridiculous. Whoa. Oh, wait, who came to save him? Oh, Teru. Ah, that's why the narrator said they missed the TV report. Let's go, Teru. <laughs> See what you can do, bro. Explosion. Hey, air whips. I remember when he learned that. Oh, so much for that. This guy's a little too OP. Oh, that's right. He learned pyrokinesis too. Dude, Teto is a prodigy, dude. Wait, no. Um, Wait, was that who I thought it was on the floor who was watching? I thought I saw Scuba Guy for a moment. Nice. I'm sure that'll help. Oh boy, Teru, help's not gonna come. He teleported inside the barriers. I guess Teru didn't know that. Welp. He tried. Oh, damn, it ended there. Dude, this is going to be... This is probably going to be the arc until the show ends, huh? Or maybe until the last episode, in which it might be some kind of epilogue kind of thing, but we'll see. Uh, damn. Very, very cool start. Okay, well, I guess, thank goodness that I my kind of suspicions or denial was correct. Of course, that was more so just me not wanting to have Mob deal with that shit for the rest of the show and, like, the rest of his canonical life, especially if they do more after this, right? Or if one writes more or has written more, I don't know. Um, yeah, dude, that, that would have sucked ass, man, from the deal with his parents and Ritsu's death or... Oh, man. I, I didn't... I wasn't ready for that, man. Of course, if if it did happen, if it did happen like that, it could have been um, 
Uh, I, I don't know, man. Because, again, if, if Dimple wasn't there to, like, calm him down and, like, not to, like, half-lie. Because he had reason to believe it wasn't legit. But he was, he didn't really know. He kind of half-lied about it. If, like, Dimple didn't, wasn't there, even Mob said, thank you for stopping me. Because Mob was about to snap, man. Because the thing about Mob, like, if that were to happen, like, if, like, if Dimple didn't stop him, even if it was or wasn't his parents dying, like, Mob would have... He just would have snapped on everything because question mark percent emerge like that's like question mark percent like in my perception at this point it's just like the rawest and deepest emotions within mob it's like something just unconscious just completely just but it's just like the bare like raw essence of whatever his emotions are that's what it seems to be it's like it's like ultimate despair or, or something um but yeah, it's I guess it's it's good it happened like that, man. That's because that's the thing. Like Mob, as long as he has the support of like Dimple, of Reagan, of his family, of everyone, around, he's gonna be all right. That's that's the main thing. Um, but, but aside from that, man, it was kind of cathartic to see Mob still just go around, just not no bullshit, just like beating the crap. It was like, hey, where's my family? Oh, wait, you're not strong enough. I'm I'm not interested. You, where's your where's my family? Right, and just when he got picked up in the car, and as soon as they said, We don't know where you're fat, he just immediately stopped the car with his powers. Like, then there's no reason for me to be because it's like I could, dude, if I didn't know like what happened to my family or one of my siblings, like that's exactly how you would be, man. You wouldn't stop for nothing. You'd like anyone trying to like get in your way or stop you or take you, like, no, man, like, no, I'm I need to figure out what happened. Um. And for Mob, that just takes on a whole new meaning with his fucking crazy ass powers, dude. But yeah, hopefully he wakes up soon because we're gonna need him against the fucking Ultimate Five and um, big leader of Claw. Because apparently, um, just out of nowhere, shit is more complex within Claw. Like Sho isn't completely on his dad's side. He's like, nah, I'm, I'm gonna be the one to stop him or defeat. Like, okay, I don't know if he said stop him, but to defeat him or something. Uh, yeah, that was that was weird and out of nowhere. I like I, 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 I did have a thought earlier. Like I wonder if Sho maybe does have a problem with this dad and might eventually come around to siding with Mob and Ritsu, like to go against them. Like I had that thought, but I, I don't know. I thought something would have sparked that rather than that just be him the whole time. But again, he is a kid and his dad's probably forced him to do this shit. Um. But I don't know. I, I'd like to learn a little bit more about that because as of now, he's like, it seemed uh, it seems he went to recruit Ritsu and he knew that they were coming for Mob's family, that they were that Claw was coming for Mob's family. So he set up the whole fire and everything and um, and the corpses, I guess, to throw them off the trail. Uh, yeah, poor Mob, though, having to deal with that in that moment. But crazy crazy that show just wanted to recruit ritsu and mob for for his own plan and then you got this these infiltrator the, the infiltrator from the japanese government going in there but he wasn't he got fucking whopped by the ultimate five man so uh yeah there you go man interest interesting stuff but um i'm more so curious to see how this is all gonna play out man i, I think the main thing i'm looking forward to is, is seeing like a mob uh mob will wake up and like do what he needs to do you know be the hero you know save the city because apparently they're just gonna their goal is to like destroy everything and ignore the claw has such a basic ass goal it's such a basic ass like super villain goal man i don't know they might try and make it uh they might give a little little more deeper reason uh as we go on and they properly confront them but um they're, they're just such an like obstacle like, I don't know. Um, anyway, it should make for, like, some pretty pretty good action, uh, for sure. But who knows, man? We might uh, we might learn some more stuff. We might uh, might see some more motivation, see what Sho can do, see what a Mob does when he wakes up and how that all plays out. Um, either way, man, I'm looking forward to some really, really good action scenes, man. Again, this show looks really good. It's, like, all the fights are awesome. Uh, yeah looking forward to it man so that's all i gotta say about this one as you can tell um but if you want early access to um the final episodes of these reactions um check out my patreon if you want to support the channel patreon.com slash yodokobe 
early access to everything I do, including anime polls and gaming polls. If you want to know when I'm doing polls, that's only like a dollar to vote in. Um, you know, check my community tab on YouTube or check my Discord. I do announcements when I'm doing those kind of polls. If I'm if the poll is in public, in which case you'll hear about it anyway. But keep an eye out for those. Um, otherwise, thank you very much for watching with me and I'll see you next time. Peace.